Good morning and welcome to the next 100 seconds. It's Monday, the 6th of April, 2020. I'm Mark Pesci. So we've been receiving a lot of very interesting advice about why or why not we might wear masks. Over the weekend, the CDC in America indicated that Americans should be wearing masks when they're out in public. Our own chief or deputy chief medical officer here in Australia said, no, nah, it's not really necessary. But here's a couple of really interesting data points. So Iceland tested pretty much everyone in the country, which is brilliant, and it yielded some very interesting data. And it said that between 25 and 50 percent of people who are infected with coronavirus and are infectious with coronavirus show no symptoms. Now, some of those people will go on to show symptoms, but probably a quarter of the people who are infected will remain infectious, will spread the infection, and will never know that they're infected. Okay, second bit of data. Dr. Anthony Fauci, the head of the Infectious Diseases Program at the CDC, said on tape on Friday that, in fact, someone who is infected can infect someone just by speaking, that, in fact, the virus particles can be carried just by the strength of the human voice. And so that means that if you are infectious and you don't know it, you can infect someone just by speaking to them. And this then comes back to this question about masks, because we all think we're wearing masks so that we don't catch the infection. In fact, it's absolutely the opposite is, in fact, true. We are wearing masks so that if we are asymptomatic carriers, we are not breathing our virus onto other people. This is the way we can keep everyone as safe as possible for as long as possible. I'm not wearing this mask to protect me. I'm wearing this mask to protect you. And that's 100 seconds.